K and look where we are today. You guessed it, the Do Re Mi Learning Antics Kitchen. Yay! Do you know why we're here? Okay, I'll tell you. <laughs> today I thought that we could celebrate one of the fun holidays that are celebrated all around the world. It's, yes, it's Easter, it's Easter. And today I want to show you how we dye Easter eggs. Uh, yes, 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 yes. We're gonna have so much fun. And I'm gonna take you step by step, okay? And I'm gonna show you exactly how to dye Easter eggs. We're gonna have so many colors, blue, yellow, red, green. There's gonna be so many fun Easter egg colors, okay? Now, I'm gonna, again, I'm gonna take you step by step. So if you wanna do this project with me, go and ask mommy, go ahead and ask daddy, and let's do it together, okay? Let's have fun dyeing Easter eggs. And also, we're gonna make an Easter egg basket to put all the Easter eggs in. And look who's joining us. <laughs> That's right, TK, little TK's in the background with his Easter bunny, purple Easter bunny ears. <laughs> so cute, okay? So, are you ready? Let's go! Okay, kiddos, how are you? So, these are what you're going to need to create this wonderful Easter egg basket. You're gonna need a basket, just like this one. You're also gonna need some fake grass. I chose purple, because I love the color purple. I have six glasses here, because we have six eggs that we're going to dye. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. And these are caps, these are bottle caps, pet bottle caps. So after we dye the egg, we're gonna take them out of the dye and put them on these caps to dry. You're gonna need some glue. I found this little flower stencil. You can use any flower stencil you want. You can actually create your own flower stencil as well. Um, these are also little flowers that I found. This is a roll of glitter, uh, uh, glitter tape and you need that as well, okay? So here's what we do. We start with six eggs, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, okay? And then we're gonna put them in this hot boiling water. Again, make sure you ask mommy and daddy for help because I do not want you to use um, boiled water by yourself, okay? Make sure you ask mommy or daddy. Now, here I have a kettle and I'm going to pour the hot water into the kettle. Also, I have all the colors here, all the dye, I have, and I have a bottle of vinegar, because you're going to need a bottle of vinegar as well. You're going to need some vinegar, a tablespoon of vinegar, okay? So we're going to pour the hot water into each glass cup, just like this. One, two, Three, four, five, and six. Okay? Now those are all finished. Now we take our vinegar and our tablespoon, and we're going to put a tablespoon of vinegar in each cup, just like this. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Perfect. Just like that. Okay? Put the cap on and all finished. Now, it's time for the colors, okay? First one, we're gonna use green. Let's pour a little bit of the dye into our hot water and vinegar mix. And look, you can already see, look, look, look. <laughs> you can already see it, right? I love, love, love. Easter time and making fun eggs like this. This is super fun. Okay? So I take a tissue and I just clean off the spoon so I don't mix the colors. Okay? So that's green. 
And the second one, red. Look at this. <gasps> Look at this. Yay! <laughs> this is red dye. Okay, once again, I take my spoon and I'm, I clean it off because I do not want to mix the colors. This one here is yellow. Yellow. It's interesting. I put orange in, but it turned out to be yellow. It's okay. It still looks really cool. <laughs> this is yellow. Now, I'm go before I put the other three colors in, I'm gonna start immersing or putting the egg into the dye. So the egg will sit in the dye for a few minutes, okay? And get all coated with all the dye, all of the egg, and it'll be a really deep color. You'll see, and I will show you. goes into the red and we put an egg into the yellow just like this now I'm testing the water to see if it's still hot because you need to really have hot water in order to melt the powder dye. And I use powder dyes. Uh, around the world, there's a lot of dyes that are liquid based. But here, I used um, powder dye. So I, did, I really had to make sure the water was really, really hot so the dye can melt perfectly. And it really did. It did a great job. I was, so, I was very, very happy. So I put the egg into the blue dye. Let it sit in there for a little bit. Stir it around. Make sure the dye gets all over the egg. Just like this. Okay, here we're mixing blue and red and kiddos, what color do we get when we mix blue and red? You guessed it, good job. Purple, purple. But in this case, we're gonna have a, a little lavender color. It's not gonna be as purple, like deep purple, but it'll be lavender, like a light purple, which is really still beautiful. So we have lavender now. Okay, and our last one here, the last color is pink. Pink, okay. Put the powder in, let it melt. And take our spoon, and we're going to mix it perfectly and nicely. And once we finish stirring it like this, we're gonna put the last egg in, okay? We put the egg inside and we stir it up nicely to make sure we get all the color all over the egg just like this okay so here we go kiddos we have all the colors and all the eggs sitting inside we have our purple one our blue one our pink our yellow 
our green and our red. And they're just gonna sit there for a few minutes. And again, the dye is gonna get all over the egg and the eggs are gonna look amazing when we take them out of the, of the water or of the dye in water. It's gonna look amazing. We have our six caps here. We put our, we're gonna put the egg on top of the caps, okay, to dry, because they have to dry. Okay, so we have green, red and purple let's see what it looks like <gasps> wow kiddos look at this green one this green one looks amazing this looks super super cool doesn't it it looks amazing so you put the green right on the cap it's going to sit there and dry and then we take the pink one hmm. well this is a light pink I guess wow I'm not really seeing pink on this one it's okay maybe I will later put it in the green dye so I have two green ones because I don't see I don't see any Pink on that one. Hmm. Oh, look at our lavender. Look at our lavender. Wow, it looks amazing. <laughs> this is our lavender. So we have lavender pink and green now we have our red yellow and our blue okay so let's take it out with the spoon very carefully look at this one <laughs> wow this is our red it looks amazing truly amazing I like the red and green one and the lavender of course my favorite look at the yellow so deep yellow this one looks amazing too wow and our last one our last one look up look at the blue <laughs> so nice we put the blue right on the cap so it can all dry. These three look amazing. The blue one, the yellow one, and the red one. All three are just phenomenal. They look so good. Uh, and little TK is here. Hi, little TK. Little TK is so happy. He's, look, he's showing you that we have a green one, a lavender one, our blue, our yellow. And remember? Here's our green, the one we changed from pink to green, and our last one, red. Bye-bye, little TK. Thank you. <laughs> now, for the second part, kiddos, we have our fake grass, our purple fake grass, okay? Now, we're going to take our fake purple grass, and we're going to put that into the basket because the eggs need a place to lay. So, let's go ahead and put start putting the fake purple grass inside the basket, okay? Just like this. So you wanna pull the grass apart too, to make room, okay? And fill it all the way up to the top, okay? Just like this. Okay. Now, once you have all the fake grass in the basket, start pulling it apart just like I'm doing here. Pull it all apart to make space for your eggs, okay? Just like that. Perfect. Now we're gonna design it, okay? Remember, we have our three flowers. We have the glue, we have the sticker tape, and we also have a flower that I made before that I'm just gonna use, okay? So right up here on this line, okay, I'm going to take this sticker tape and I'm gonna stick it 
right on the top, just like this. Watch. Just like that, okay? And make sure, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna make sure I try my best to even it out, okay? It's kind of even, okay? And now, I'm just gonna place these three flowers, pink and two blues, right in the middle here, on the left, in the middle, and the right. Just like this, watch. Okay, perfect, perfect. Now we have our flower. And this is gonna be very decorative. Look, it's perfect. We put it right there on the, I put it a little bit to the right. I didn't wanna put it uh, center or to the left, but I think the right is perfect. So I put it just a little to the right so it can give it a little fashionable <laughs> basket. Put my glue on the back. And I glue it right to the right, just like this. Ta-da! Perfect. Perfect. Now, I have my black marker, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to give all the eggs faces, <laughs> different facial expressions, okay? Here we are with our yellow one. He's silly. He's a thinker. This one is very smart. The red one is a thinker. I like his glasses. <laughs> we wrote, we drew glasses on this thinker. Each one of these Easter eggs have a, has a different personality. This one is singing. He loves to sing. And he's a great singer, too. <laughs> and he, <laughs> he just likes to be funny. He likes to make people laugh. <laughs> and he just likes to he, he just likes to talk to people and make friends. He's a nice one. And this one, he's, he's just, <laughs> he's just always happy. He loves people who are happy. So there you go, kiddos. All six of our amazing Easter egg 
Easter dye eggs. Amazing. We dyed, we color dyed six eggs. They are now in the basket, sleeping. <laughs> they had a very fun time in the dye. <laughs> See, we placed them right in the middle of our fake grass, right in the basket, and they're just nicely relaxed. Hey kiddos, so that video was so fun. Did, was, did you have fun creating those amazing, amazing Easter eggs? Now remember, you can do that. You can do that with your mommy. You can do that with your daddy, your friends. It is so fun to create Easter eggs, Easter egg uh, color, different colors, right? It's so much fun. I love dyeing Easter eggs around Easter time. It's so, so fun. So remember, we have more videos coming your way. And please, 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 oh, subscribe. <laughs> Tell all your friends about Dormy Learning Antics, and we'll see you in the next video, okay? <laughs> we love you. Bye!